Bronx student stabs teenager despite school metal detector. The knife in the book bag. Man fatally shot after standoff. What was the most violent thing you've ever seen? Most violent, um, they shot my man and I had it right in front of me. Well, actually, I was standing in front of my building with my year old kid in my arms and a shootout broke out with two different sets of drug dealers shooting at each other over territory and I got hit once to the neck, became paralyzed from the chest down and lost the use of my hands along with that. Has violence increased? Some guys, they don't, they don't fight no more. They just ready to pull out a gun. Let's show who's bad. The violence, the level of violence has increased somewhat. It's, uh, it, it hasn't, it used to be where kids would just get into a fist fight and it would be a fist fight and that's it. And that's violence. But now it's become more to a thing where they would bring out weapons, you know, knives and guns and stuff like that. So it's become more violent. It's mostly fist fights. You might see a stick or a bat or a bottle, but now it's getting really wild out there. We must all learn to live together as brothers, or we will perish together as fools. We must all learn to live together as brothers, or we will perish together as fools. We must all learn to live together as brothers, or we will perish together as fools. What do you think we can do to stop violence? I mean, if you change, like, you look at this project, so it looks peaceful from here, but Inside, it's a whole different thing. You know, they got kids staying outside till late at night. They don't know no better. Their parents not teaching them the better. Their parents are crackheads, so they learn from the street what they see as violence. So if the city could help this, make it better, you know, um, improve the programs, improve the housing, then some kids won't have to grow up that way. And violence might stop. I won't say it will, but it might calm down a little. And as far as me stopping violence, um, I really don't know. I mean, I could keep my calm, keep my head, go see a therapist or something like that, you know, but that's, that's about it. You just have to learn how to keep your calm and don't fall victim to peer pressure or your friends telling you, ooh, you a punk or something like that.